Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone having a wonderful day. Before starting this video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Uncomfortable, K.H. Lo Kardashian said. The paternity scandal involving Tristan Thompson on the Kardashians. It's a tough thing to swallow. The paternity suit drama involving Tristan Thompson eventually made its way to Hulu's The Kardashians, although Katie Chlo Kardashian didn't completely avoid viewing. The friendships of the Kardashian-Jenner family with their exes. A guide, the 37-year-old good American co-founder, opened up about how it felt to see the drama develop on reality TV while talking with followers on social media during the new episode on Thursday, June 9. It makes me uncomfortable to watch this segment again, yet I love and respect my family more than words can convey. Praise the Lord, I have them for the rest of my life, she tweeted, accompanied by three red heart emojis. Kim Kardashian, Kylie Jenner, and Kourtney Kardashian found out Thompson 30 was being sued for child support by Marilee Nichols, who claimed he was the father of her baby boy, on Thursday's episode, which ended on a cliffhanger. This is Tristan speaking, these are his words, says the narrator. This is the entirety of his declaration. Kim, 41, told her sisters over the phone that her father is requesting a paternity test and admits to having sex with her. Cage Lo gave him a party to celebrate his 30th birthday. So, after the 30th birthday celebration, he went home, went to Houston, Texas, to perform on the road. We can look at his calendar and then slept with this female. The Kardashians, everything K.H. Lo and her family have said about Tristan. The whole situation is extremely sad because she wanted a newborn boy, the Skims CEO stated. And now she's giving birth to a F. King baby boy. He slept with a F. King stranger one night. He's F. Ked. I was all for him. We don't know if K.H. Lo is aware. How can we tell if she's aware? That's the problem. We have no idea. We have no idea if she even knows. She's not responding at all. The case was first reported in December 2021, and Nichols gave birth later that month, according to Us Weekly. In January, the NBA player announced his paternity on social media, apologizing to Kardashian, with whom he was still seeing at the time his son was conceived. Is Tristan the wretchedest person on the face of the earth? I'm shaking for her, Jenner, 24, said over the phone to Kim. My heart breaks for her. Thompson previously cheated on K.H. Lo while she was pregnant with True, their now four-year-old daughter. While the couple initially kept their relationship going for the sake of their daughter, they called it quits in February 2019 when the Canadian basketball player was found kissing Jordan Woods. The on-again, off-again pair resumed their romance during the coronavirus epidemic the following year, but they called it quits for good in June 2021. This has to be the last sign she gives. This is insane, Kylie Cosmetics founder Kris Jenner said on Thursday's show, adding, she doesn't deserve this. It's real time. The baby album of K.H. Lo Kardashian and Tristan Thompson's daughter before the start of the Kardashians in April, the K.H. Lo and Lamer actress told Variety that her ex's misdeeds on the program would not be a long, drawn-out scenario, but would not be avoided. We try to safeguard the privacy of our partners or significant others as a family, she said in March, since they didn't actually sign up for this, we did. However, if something is as public as this, it would be bizarre if Tristan was a part of the program, and then he vanishes and we never talk about it. Nichols, on the other hand, claims Thompson abandoned her and their kid, Theo. In February, her rep told us, despite public allegations to the contrary, Tristan Thompson has done nothing to help their son. Neither has he attempted to meet their son, nor has he offered any financial aid. On Thursdays, new episodes of The Kardashians premiere on Hulu. Stay tuned with Gossip Time. Thank you for your support. Goodbye.